Compressed air for auxiliary purpose. Compressed air system. Compressed air is used on board ship for various purposes. For various uses, the pressure of air may be different. Starting of diesel engines, clean and dry air, 20 to 30 bars. Control air system, 7 bars. Operation of hand tools and machines, 7 bars. Pneumatic hammers. Life boat winch. Gangway lifting motor. Hatch cover operation. Pneumatically operated pumps. Etc. Charging of breathing apparatus bottles, around 220 bars. Cleaning of parts, 7 bars. Onboard ship compressed air is used for starting main engine and auxiliary engine. Operation of ships. Whistle. And for many tools such as drill machines. Grinders. Etc. Air in its natural state cannot do any of the above mentioned tasks. Unless it is compressed, that is work done on air. On compression temperature and pressure increases while volume decreases. This is done by air compressor. Air compressor runs by electric motor to do the work of adding energy to air. Ships are fitted with at least two air compressor and compressed air is stored in air bottles. Care should be taken while using compressed air. Compressed air may with very pressure such 30 bar in the air bottle which is used for steering engines. We should be careful while opening the main valve. If we open the valve too quickly air will enter the pipe leading to engines at very high speed and may cause damage to the pipe. Hence, we should first open the valve very little. Crack open. Let the pressure stabilize and then open the valve full. While using compressed air for cleaning purpose. Pressure should not be more than 2 bars or 2 kg per square centimeter. While using compressed air for cleaning purpose. Make sure to hold the end of the pipe of the nozzle and then only the compressed air valve should be opened. If the valve is opened with holding the end of the pipe. The pipe may swing and hit somebody causing injury. Air bottles are provided with drain valves. Accumulated condensed water should be drained off regularly else the water will enter the engines.